All right, let's get it. Let's. All right, let's get this deal with then. My little chest guy. Oh, yeah. This, this should be no problem. Look at that. Yes. Stay away from Maxwell. All of you, stay away from Maxwell. Get out of my village. Oh, he just fell down the elevator. Another saucer up here. Just throw that. No, throw that up there. Yes. I am too powerful for you guys. Ah, oh, that's not good. <laughs> Oi! I didn't see that. Get out of here! Hey, Goblin Army's been defeated. It should be you guys, leftovers. Okay. And I believe that's done. Alright, hello guys. Welcome back to another episode, episode of, of Terraria. Now, today we have a lot to get through, so there's no wasting time. First up, I still have all my Queen Bee stuff. Let's quickly put some in chests and sell them. What the hell does a bed classify as? Can be placed. Uh, I'll just place the bed random for now. You're telling me I can't place a bed in here. And you are having a laugh. There you go, spawn point. As I said, I have a lot to do today. And with a nice, clean... And with a nice... I told you I have a lot of stuff to do today. And I have a nice, cleaned out inventory ready to do some stuff with. I am going to be decorating my elevator first, but I, but I, I won't bore you with that. I'll just show you a speed up version. Anyway, back up! I've got so much stuff and gold on me! Ah! Actually, you know what? Big brain idea. I'm gonna kill myself and jump, and hopefully, placing that stone slab means. Yes. And my gold should stay there. Look at what's down here. That's my money. Yes. And that's the end of the super fast build. Now, you may be asking yourself, did I complete the entire elevator? Well, well, my friend, I have to tell you that, and I have to say, no. No, I did not. <laughs> Let me just quickly take a quick dive here. All of this, what you are currently seeing, took me around an hour's work. And quite frankly, I can't be bothered to do the rest, so I'll just do it another time. I did also extend the elevator down as I drained out that lava pool area. Oh. And get this little area here, which I can dig down more, but will be stopped by that lava pocket. Now, I have decided to come down to hell, as I'm wanting to defeat the wall of flesh today. And making a bigger elevator means I can easily get back down to hell without doing all of this. The wall of flesh is like a boss that you must do, as it allows you to go into a brand new mode and change like the difficulty of your world. It also creates a brand new biome called the Hallow, which I believe Katie Daenerys wants to live in. Alright, down in hell, we need we need a long platform to fight the Wall of Flesh on. And I don't have anything that I can build platforms out of. Wait, yes I can, that's a lie. I'll build stone pla- Okay, I don't have anything I can build platforms out of, so... And he says I. Uh, well... If I just craft up my stone blocks into grey bricks, then I'll be able to craft some platforms. Alright, got around 956 stone platforms and some grey bricks left over. That's because I am wanting some honey for the battle, as honey allows you to regenerate your health quicker 
if you just like dip your thing not your fingers, if you dip your toes in, look at the top, I now have better life regeneration, which is for sure gonna help out. And I should also need a clean inventory. Now that is more like it. I should also need some potions as well. Uh, I'll take a fawns. Take a shine. Um, life. Obsidian skin. And... Hat Ridge. And... Now to hell. Where I can start farming my hell bridge. A hell bridge is where you just place a rose like this of platforms and you just... I don't know, it's just, it's just big lines, then the wall of flesh can't catch up to you. Jesus Christ, that seagull's so loud. Okay, I keep, I keep on hearing snorting sounds, and I don't know what mob is making that. I also brought some campfires for the battle, and that's also another way to regenerate my health. It's actually summon in the wall of flesh. You need to kill a voodoo demon, and it'll have a guide voodoo doll. And you have to sacrifice that into lava. So I'm hoping while I'm building this, that does not happen. You know, while I'm at it, I might as well search some buildings, you know? They could have a shadow chest. Okay, this one doesn't have a shadow chest, so let's move on. Does this building have a shadow chest or not? Hey, I see that. And it's a... Another treasure magnet! Hey, hey, no, okay, no. That one has a guide voodoo doll. One minute. Hey, okay. Co co come up here, demon. Come up here. I swear. You better not die above lava. Cause that's how you summon him in. No. No, come on. No, imp. How, how, do, how do I get rid of my imp? No, 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 no. How, how, how do I get rid of you? Okay, there we go. Oh. Okay. We have a guide voodoo doll. Thankfully, it didn't land in the lava, so we're safe. Any shadow chests? A lot of health forges. Oh, that's a shadow chest. This one has... A Hellwing Bow, okay. Demonic Hellcat, um, I'll equip that, for sure. Bruh. A Goblin, another Goblin Army! <laughs> well, I guess if I don't defeat the Wall of Flesh and I die, I'll have a pleasant surprise to go back to. A Goblin Army has arrived. It has arrived? Well, why don't the Goblins just come and face me down in Hell then? I mean, are they, are they too shy? Can't they handle the heat? Wait, so if they're arrived, does that mean they're attacking my NPCs now? Because if so, that would suck. Anyway, so I've hit this, and to be honest, I can't be bothered going through it, so... I'm just gonna head back and just do more of the, um, hell bridge this way. You know, to be honest, I don't think the Wall of Flash will actually be too hard. I think that with my weapons and stuff, I should easily get him. And that's the last of the Hellbridge. That is a solid stack worth, and on the map, it looks like this. Goes on for a pretty long time, then stops. I have a feeling that this should be enough for the Wall of Flesh. Now, I feel like this battle can go two ways. One, I die and I have to fight the Goblin. Or two, I, I win and have all of the good loot that I ever want. Which... I'm kind of wanting the second one, to be honest. I mean, aren't we all? Oh, okay, that's bad, that's bad. Okay, come here, demon. You better not drop that in lava. Uh, oh, grab it, grab it. Oh. God, that was close. Let's sip up shine, obsidian, heart reach, restoration. That's a bad idea. And fawns, and throw in the guy's voodoo doll. Oh, there he is on the mini-map. Can you see him? There he is. Get a wall of flesh. Key is with this um, fight is to dodge and to not run away from him. As if you run away from him, he, he becomes overall faster, and it's and it's more likely for me to run out of my platform. Get 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 rid of the hungry. There we go. So it's it's just him left now. And is that a worm? <laughs> I believe his eyes are his weak points, so I shall go after them more. But he's yeah, he's past half health. He isn't really doing a lot of damage, to be honest. I'm still on 300 hearts. Yeah, he does, only does 8 damage. Yeah, this should be well easy. Yeah, it just, it just got them regurgitated away, and that's disgusting. <laughs> oh, see, look, he, he's getting faster. No, get away from me. Get away. 
as I, I probably missed out on some of my honey pockets. That's because I wasn't paying attention. But either way, he should die in three, two, one. One. There we go. Hey, yo, what's that? I see a big sword. Breaker blade. Ooh. Okay, one minute. Let, let's let's all of this rotten goods go. Oh, I got an, I got a wall of flesh mask. Okay, let's break open the box with my pickaxe and see what's in it. All right, we got wall of flesh mask, pawn hammer, and breaker blade. Nice. So breaker blade. Oh, that big. That big. Look at this. 90 damage, bro. I have noticed also, there's another guide. Uh, yeah, there's another voodoo demon here. Let's quickly kill him. Setting hard, setting hard mode. Wait, did I just waste a guide voodoo doll? It says setting hard mode on the bottom. Do I have to wait for it to be in hard mode? Wait, no, that's a hard mode, boss. I know that. Wait, is this the hollow here? Oh, it is. All of this cobblestone has been turned into. I believe it's called pellstone. Yeah, it's been turned into pellstone blocks. Alright, so my hallow is spawned here. Yeah, so this part of my world here looks like it's gonna be hallow, but it hasn't updated it on the map. Okay. Hey, no. Oh, I'm on 9 health! Hey, no, 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 no. Heal potion. So, I'm fighting hard mode bosses while it's setting up hard mode. Okay, then. Yeah, it looks like I just have to wait for hard mode to happen then. Ancient spirits of light and dark have been released. Okay, so I'm assuming I'm now in hard mode. So, back on the map. This is this gonna be hello now? Okay, no. All right. So by the looks, hey. So by the looks of the map, I dropped in from up here. Yeah, this looks right. Oh wait, what? Okay, this has now been turned into a corrupt biome. That's nice to see. So I believe this is where I'll. This is where I'm going to get my Souls of Night from now, I guess. The goddamn corrupted enemies in hard mode can goddamn suck a big one. Oh, yep, this is the hammer. This hammer is really annoying. Go away. Nice, Souls of Night. It, it might actually be an idea to get some obsidians, and I can craft an obsidian skill potion. Those allow you to be immune to fire blocks, which I shall happily take right now. Oh, the worm's back. Hey, yo, yo, not at the worm. That, if anything, that's goddamn more of the boss now. Hey, okay, so corrupt ends here. So it hasn't affected all my. Um, wow, what's it called? Hell of it. hasn't affected all my help here. That's nice. Go away, hammer. Back up the vein, here we go. Hey, yo, what are you doing here? Go away. Hey, whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. Get out of here. Oh, yeah, goblin army. Forgot about that. Okay, let me get to the surface. Oh, yeah, because this is now hardcore, I now get this guy for goblin army. Goblin summoner. Ah, god. And she's so tanky as well. God. Hardware's gonna suck into it. God, I'm, I'm gonna die. Nope. Nope, fatty health. I can't use my heal potion. Go away. Ah! No! Oh! Fighting health. Yeah, so this is a part of the series where you can see that I am not a good Terraria player. As I was just killed to the goblin army. I mean... <laughs> goblin army, seriously. Mage, no, he's dead. Come on. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Nice. Oh, that's a bow. One minute. What do I, what do I need? Don't need an obsidian phase. Intimidating Shadow Flame Bow. Ooh. Okay. It's... It, it is what it says. It's a Shadow Flame Bow. But look at that. It actually sounds pretty cool. Listen. Ooh, that sounds nice. Yeah, I don't know if that Goblin Summoner... Summon, I don't know if that Goblin Summoner is going to come back, but I sure hope it doesn't, as I do not want to be fighting her again. But who knows? I might actually drop some really cool loot. Oh, she's back. All right, come here. I have I have your loot now. Therefore, I can kill you. Oh. Ah. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Oh. No. Okay. She is standing still. This is my chance. No. I was gonna say this. This is my chance to go get her. Like, do damage. There we go. 
Look at that, that did 100 damage. Oh, wait, I'm nearly dead again. What? No. Uh. Mm, just do dodge and weave, dodge and weave, dodge and weave. <sighs> Alright, come on. Die. 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 Hey, she dropped another bow. <laughs> okay, I can't pick it up though. My inventory full though. Alright, okay, come here. This is a. Ooh, this is superior. Um, I don't need the hell about thing. Oh. I feel like I'm at that time of the game where I need to purchase a piggy bank from the merchant. And I'll just put all my important stuff in it, like my souls of light. Now, who do I want to build for? No, I feel like building for the dryad, so let's build her a house. I think bamboo shall work in the jungle, along with some mahogany mud. Wood, mahogany wood, some rich mahogany wood. You know, I've been thinking. Bill, I'm gonna be building the dryad's house in the jungle. I should have probably built it in the jungle before I entered hard mode. Let's just say that. Oh, yep, that's a death link. And a tortoise. No, stay away from me. Oh, no. No, stay away. Death link does 59 damage. Oh, God. Stay away from me. Oh, no. There's more death link. Okay, just run. Jesus Christ, so many death links. Oh, my God, more death link. No, be gone. Shut up with that. Oh no, they're closing on me. They're closing in on me. No. Stay away, please. I, I need my imp staff quickly out. Yes, got it in time. No, go away. Oh my god, look at all the daplings. Mm. Oh wait, no. I'm gonna die from this. Ah, oh, dapling, why? Okay. I'm not gonna build dry at a house, I'm gonna wait later. <laughs> that was an absolute disaster. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be building Dryad's house for a long time now. Alright, let's choose someone else. Now, let's build the Mechanica house. She is snow, so... What, what to build out of? I don't know, actually. Planked wall does seem fitting for the snow by ice, yes. Wooden beams. And some barrel wood, so let's go there. Wait, before I do go there... I know, I keep on changing my mind. But... I have these potions, and there's one of them called Gravitation Potion. I'll take both, and I'm wanting to try and find a Sky Island. This is like the best way to find them. Okay, so a Gravitation Potion, you drink it, and you press down. Oh, okay, you press up, then you fly. And you can find um, Sky Islands, just, just like this one right here. Man, that was lucky. Damn, I got so lucky with that. Literally straight away found one. The heck, they have these chests. I'm looking for a balloon or a horseshoe. That is a horseshoe. This negates fall damage. Very useful. I am wanting some of that rain cloud block, but I'll get it later because I'm on a time limit right now. Alright, jump off and onto the next sky island. Yep, if you, go, if you go too far up. Hey, there's another sky island here. What the hell? Okay, this one is a lake. So, these are useful for um, fishing quests that you get from Sammy. And I'm about to die. Switch gravity. Haha. <laughs> I won't die today. Oh, we have found another Sky Island. Is this one actually going to be Sky Island or a Sky Lake? Uh, oh. Okay. So, we have found another Sky Lake. Okay, we have found another Sky Island. This one actually has a house on it. Oh. Okay, that was confusing. Alright. Red shiny balloon. Okay, another horseshoe. All right. Hey, wait, wait, wait! I just saw it on the mini map. A goddamn demolitionist moved into here. What are you doing here, giraffe? You like you like the underground? What are you doing here, buddy? Okay, sorry, I have only have a minute left of my gravitation potion, so I'll talk to you later. Oh wait, okay, that's another Sky Island. Oh, okay. What in this chest? Hey, rich any balloon? Yes. Uh, I don't. I don't think I'm gonna find another one. Four, three, two, one, zero. Yep, didn't find another one. But hey, I got what I was looking for, so I consider this as a success. All right, we're in the snow biome. Looks of things. Looks pretty calm. Nice to see. Let's mine up some burrow wood. That is an ice elemental. I found my first hard mode boss here. 
Hey, look at that guy. That guy's a thick eye of Cthulhu. Look at him. What, what, what's he called? War Wandering Eye. Mana Crystal has been made. I'm wanting to build, um, Seller's House in, like, by a lake. And I'm wanting this area, but I'm wanting to wall it off first where I can do it. This torch marks one pillar has been made. I'm not gonna lie, the wolf, the wolf just be chilling in the water. Oh no, he come to attack. 58, ooh, 58 damage. Damn. Okay, I feel like I'm getting nowhere with this. Let's just. Uh, okay, pile up here. No, wolf. Let's build pillar number two. Let's flatten out this terrain here. Logan the guy has arrived. I'm gonna kill you, Logan. So, for this house, I am thinking of a base and a box or two. And with a single sizzity snizzity snap of my fingers to build a wonderful house for the mechanic. Now, you may be thinking, why is this room is a different wall to all the others? Well, that's because I couldn't be bothered to go back home, so it's a different wall, alright? I have a nice chimney here, and I've actually added some snow on top to you know, act like it's been snowing. I've also added some ice torches around. Wait a minute, let me get rid of these slimes. Yeah, I've added some ice torches around, so then when it's night, the whole snowy area lights up blue around it. Overall, I think I did a pretty good job on this house, even though I don't plan anything on my houses. Thing that I think this looks pretty good. Let's get back to the house. As this elevator is still a hazard. <laughs> Stone slabs. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> right, so we have a new guide, Logan, and let's go kill him by defeating the Wall of Flesh again. All right, I am in position. Let's go drink up some of our potions. Ah, one minute. I didn't bring any potions. <laughs> ah, well, let's see how this goes. Bye, Logan. <laughs> I, have a, I have a new bow now that I got from the Goblin Army. Got on around half health. Cedric the Clothier has arrived. Clothier? Oh yeah, from from Skeletron, man, he got them showed up late. Oh, this is the this is the wall of flesh loot that dropped last time. Alright, come on. Come on, you're nearly dead. Hey, there we go. What did I get this time? Oh, okay, break fruit. Oh, okay. I got Hallowed Torches, Violent Sorcerer Emblem, and a another pawn hammer. Nice. Let's head back to the surface. Where I'm going to check up on my NPCs, like a seller. I thought you were supposed to be in the snow biome. <laughs> what are you selling? To be honest, I don't see a difference. Frank, what are you selling? Disco ball. Grab that. Put that there. Hey, there you go, Frank. You know, you get a nice disco ball. And wait. Hey, hey, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, dryer, dryer, dryer. I need dryer. Goddamn corruptor spreading. I forgot that happens when you're in hard mode. Bloody corrupt spreads, doesn't it? Ah! Shop, shop, shop. Um, purification powder. Yes. Give me these. Okay, I'll buy some purification powder, then I'll have to, like, dig a line or something. I don't want the, the corrupt spreading to my um, desert. Yeah, the goddamn are here right at my doorstep. Go away. Uh, go. This isn't really doing a line to it. But hey, it's doing something. Let me let me create a barrier here. Create a big line that goes all the way down. Ah! Hey, look at that! It's spreading as, as I speak. Yeah, I need to quickly do this. Oh wait, what the hell is that? That's a desert mummy. I feel like I I have to just break up all of this sand here. God! Can't believe it's spreading. Oh no! Oh no! I'm gonna die. Oh! Can't believe the gut I'm corrupt here. Mm, I don't like it. Go away. That's right. Need to make sure that every single one of the blocks on the left side are gone. Okay, there's some more corrupt blocks down here. Oh god, this it's gonna be so hard in hard mode, man. Hence the name, hard mode. Ah Dark Mummy. 
Get rid of that and that. Okay, there's there's one all the way over there. How how the hell am I supposed to deal with this? Like, how do you normally deal with the corrupt spreading? Honestly, I have no idea. Oh, don't know what's happening. Go away. I'm moving in slow motion now. Break this line here. God, there's so many mobs. Why is it always when I'm wanting to do like the most important stuff? It has to be night. I'm gonna die again! No, 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 no! Oh! <sighs> yeah, so, I currently have a crisis right now. I need to be constantly defending this battle of Teth over here. C kind of like Teth Takeover, but on a lot more serious scale. <laughs> I. Oh. Okay, that lighting was weird. <laughs> yeah, I really should have waited. I really should have waited! Wait, what happened, what happened to my arm stealer? This house is corrupted. Uh... So, I defeated the wall of flesh. I made it into hard mode. I built cell at a house. I defeated the wall of flesh again. So... Oh wait, no, you're being attacked. And now I'm struggling hard over here. Having a tef war and constantly being killed by these enemies. Well, I think this is a perfect time to end today's episode. If you are enjoying the Terraria series, let me know. And can you also let me know how to deal with this corruption problem? As I don't want it to spread any closer. Or, yeah, I just want it to be moved back to where its original space was. I have five other episodes on this series of Terraria that you can go watch right now. And yeah, this has been me, the Epicat Nugget, and I shall see you. Ah, later, 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 yeah, later.